Plantation Agriculture in Kerala In this module you will learn about the practice of plantation agriculture in Kerala. The plantation agriculture refers to the cultivation of cash crops on large estates or plantations. Kerala is famous for plantation agriculture. Some of the plantation crops cultivated here are rubber, coffee, tea, coconut and spices. Let us study each of these crops in detail. Rubber is prepared from the latex of a tree called Hevia brasiliensis. The rubber tree is tapped to get the latex. This activity requires skill and practice. A tapper makes a downward slanted cut above 2 mm deep in the bark of the tree and 1.5 meters above the ground. The latex is collected in a cup that is fixed at the bottom of cup. The workers later collect these cups and pour the latex into a large bucket. Tapping is done on alternate days. Rainy days are avoided since rainwater dilutes the latex. Fresh latex needs to be protected from the sun's heat and immediately carried to processing unit. Rubber trees have a productive life of 20 to 25 years. Rubber grows on flat, or gently sloping land. Rubber requires a high temperature of 25 degrees centigrade to 35 degrees centigrade, an annual rainfall of about 200 centimeters without long dry spells. Rubber is cultivated in deep, rich and well-drained soil. Cultivation of rubber requires cheap and adequate supply of labor. Kerala is the largest producer of rubber in India. Kottayam, Kollam, Ernakulam and Kozi Kod are the main districts in Kerala that produce rubber. Tea requires a temperature of 25 degrees centigrade to 30 degrees centigrade and an annual rainfall of more than 400 centimeters. Tea is cultivated in deep and well-drained red soil. The soil should be gently rolled in order to prevent water logging. In Kerala, Tea is cultivated on the hill slopes of the southwestern Ghats, such as in the Nilgiri Hills, Kadamom Hills, Annamalai Hills, and Palani Hills. Idukki, Bayanad, and Mallapuram are the other places where tea is produced. Coffee requires a temperature of 20 degrees Celsius to 30 degrees Celsius and an annual rainfall of 100 centimeters to 200 centimeters. Coffee is cultivated in deep, well-drained, slightly acidic red soil, which is rich in organic matter. The coffee plantations are situated along the hill slopes at an altitude of approximately 500 to 1000 meters above the mean sea level. Coffee is cultivated in the northeastern parts of Kerala, in the districts of Kasargod, Kannur, Vayanad, Kozikod, Mallapuram and Palakkad. The robusta variety of coffee is grown in these regions. Coconut is the second most essential crop in Kerala after paddy. Coconut trees can grow to an approximate height of 900 meters from the mean sea level. Coconut requires a temperature of 27 degrees Celsius to 32 degrees Celsius and an annual rainfall of about 100 centimeters to 150 centimeters. Coconut is grown in sandy and saline soil. It requires mild salty sea breeze, plenty of sunshine and water to grow. In Kerala, coconut grows in the coastal districts of Kozi Kod, Ernakulam, Alapuzza, Kollam and Thiruvananthapuram. The important spices cultivated in Kerala are pepper, cardamom, cinnamon, cloves and ginger, nutmeg, vanilla, turmeric and curry leaves are the other spices grown in Kerala. Spices require temperature of 20 degrees Celsius to 30 degrees Celsius 
and rainfall more than 250 centimeters. Spices are grown in loamy soil. Ginger, which is cultivated on Malabar coast, requires red and laterite soil. Spices are grown on the lowlands as well as in the highlands. Kozi Kod, Kottayam, Kollam, Idduki, and Tiruvananthapuram are places where spices grow. Let us now recap all the important points that we have covered in this module on plantation agriculture.